If our WooCommerce store receives hundreds of orders periodically, those orders accumulate in our database and take up space on our server. If you delete hundreds of orders manually in WooCommerce, the plugin will try to delete them all at once and your server may crash. Besides, you could spend lots of hours depending on the number of orders you have to delete. In this video, we'll show you how to filter and delete WooCommerce orders using an intuitive spreadsheet inside WordPress. You'll find the link to download the plugin in the description of the video, as well as a link to our written tutorial. We'll walk you through some examples of how to remove completed orders from WooCommerce. If you only want to remove specific orders, you can select them manually using the checkbox picker on the first column of the spreadsheet. Also, you can use our search tool to filter your orders by keyword, products included in the order, the customer who made the order, keywords in order notes, or using any other field as a search parameter. In this example, we'll search for all the completed orders by date range. Namely, we'll find the orders from May the 1st to August the 31st. For this, open the search tool and enable the advanced filters. Then, search for status. Select equal. And select completed as the value. Now, select the date range here. Finally, run the search, and all the orders that were completed between May the 1st and August the 31st will be shown in the spreadsheet. Once you've filtered the completed orders by date range, let's see how to move them to the trash. Just open the bulk edit tool. Now let's select the status field. Select set value in this dropdown. And now choose trash. Finally, you need to execute, and all the selected orders will be moved to the trash. With this option, you'll still be able to find the orders if you need to. If you want to completely remove the selected orders from your site and database, you need to change the trash value and replace it with delete completely. Now just execute, and the orders will be removed completely from your site and database. If you don't want to filter the WooCommerce orders, and instead you want to clean up your WooCommerce orders database, you can use our automatic deletion option. Just select this option that states that all the rows will be removed, and then hit execute. Just take into account that the orders will be removed completely from your site and database. Clearly, using the WooCommerce orders spreadsheet will save you a lot of time. Besides, you'll avoid server issues, since the plugin removes the orders in batches. Remember that you'll find a link to the written guide in the description of the video, as well as a link to download the plugin. You can get free live chat assistance on our website and access hundreds of tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, so you don't miss any of our tutorials.